I kind of want to share something. I really don't feel as if I'm being led to share it, but me, myself, I just want to put it out here. God has allowed me to see different entities that are in my home. Some of it has come through my peripheral vision. Some of them have been caught on my security cameras. And some have just been with me having the awareness that there's another presence that's near me or in my vicinity. But what I'm trying to say is that We now have the conscience to see, feel, communicate with the different species. I don't know how to just how to say what I'm trying to say. But we have the ability now to to see them, feel them. But what my thing is, each separate entity that I have experienced in my home now in this dispensation that our awareness has been illuminated even more we have the ability even more now in this time to experience these different energies entities that's sharing our close vicinity So one of the things that I'm putting out in the air is that certain ones struck fear at first and then certain ones, uh, because of the teachings that I've grown in this spiritual walk, uh, it has given me, uh, oh, I'm fine with it being here. But then when I experienced this latest one at first it struck alarmness and but then a couple of days in this sighting God brought peace my spirit is at peace and what I feel like what I want to do is is maybe communicate because a few of the other entities that I experienced in this home I'm in, I'm always seeing them in my home. It's like the the first ones I seen were light, bright entities. I didn't, I just welcomed it or knew aware that they are here. But then a couple of days ago, it was a dark, shadowy entity. Again, from the different Christianity basis teaching that I had, the light, bright entity, it I was okay with it. I'm not scared. But then when I saw the shadowy, dark entity, it struck, it didn't strike 
fear, it struck me wanting to get in a domineering thing and cast it out. And I went through this experience in the 80s as well, where I had a vision and plain day as in plain as day that God revealed the different realms. I experienced the day realm. I experienced the night realm. And again, when I first experienced it in the 80s, I like one is good and one is evil. But as my evolution and my spiritual walk, I don't want to be aware of any good or any evil, that type of division. Because, and, and to be honest, when that, when I saw the dark, entity a couple of days ago I opened all my windows I lit my incense I walked all around my house I'm talking in tongues I'm casting out this and but now as I'm sitting here at about 4 a.m in the morning now it's like my spirit is saying you know from the teachings that I was growing up in, in my spiritual journey, I'm not perceiving things as I should. The bright, I want to treat one way, and then the dark, I want to treat another way. I'm aware of both. Okay. All right. All right. Oh, wow. How do I want to share this? It's like if I allow every flower, every tree, every animal, uh, if I allow live and let live, we're in the same world. We're sharing the same world. I know we're all here. So now if God is allowing me to see different spirits, energies, entities, different realms within my presence, if I don't sense in my spirit, this is not, this is trying to hurt me or this is something, whatever, I'm, I, I don't feel the need to cast nothing out. I apologize. It's like I'm not, I don't even know my mind and my spirit right now are, are, hasn't become in alignment, but it's getting there because my spirit is, is, in the midst of bringing awareness to me. So that has to register with my mind. But as my spirit is revealing to me, it's allowing me to see different realms. And I feel the presence to not be afraid to not try to cast nothing out because we're sharing even if God has allowed me to be in their realm or they're allowed in my realm I I don't who am I to cast something out uh we're I, we're here in this world 
Either I'm in their world realm or they're in mine. But who am I to say, get out. It hasn't done anything to me. I just want to be able to allow the spirit to move as it will. And I want to always stay in the open-mindedness and awareness if it needs to communicate good, lovely, and pure my way. Oh, it's very much welcome. Whether it's a dark, shadowy entity or a bright, shining light entity. Either or, if they're having something to do to enhance this walk in this natural world, I welcome it. I stay open to receive knowledge and wisdom that I can relate, communicate, experience what is to be given to me to bring whatever advancement, enhancement to my life, to the world, whatever the case may be. But I don't want to be in the box of when I'm witnessing different entities in my my presence to let that mindset of I cast you out. I buy no I I I my spirit right now is like you didn't have to do that a couple of days ago. It's like the entity is telling me I am not coming in no way to harm to hurt you in no way. So I can't be biased, whether bright light or dark shadow. I I, I can't be prejudiced. That's just like in this natural world. I can't be prejudiced against one race and another race, or your dark skin and your light skin. That uh 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 I I uh, I can't do that. So God is showing me since he's now allowing me to 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 witness the different entities here in this natural realm I can't be biased against that either I can't be prejudiced against one cuz one looked like this and another looked like that But God understands this is not normal. This is paranormal. This is, we're not used to this. So he understands that we will be shocked, alarmed, fearful at first. And I thank the spirit for not giving us too much that we can't handle. And as he brings these different things as the spirit allow more and more to be uh, opened within us and without us we can be able to share experiences i'm not going to say anything well that's i won't even go there cuz that's that's something else i can't break down but to be able to say that some of us will be and have been experiencing things in our natural realm, whether we saw it with our own natural eye or whether we were caught up in the spirit to witness this or whether our cameras caught it or if it's not just let us breathe and experience the spirit within the 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 the, is it striking fear but is that fear coming from some 
knowledge you had in the past or is it a true alarmness within your spirit to for you to have a reason to fear and stuff or are you being caught up in that old teaching that you had that will limit you from experiencing something new that is here. I believe I'm getting the point over. Those who have ears to hear, let them hear. Have a good night. Well, it's becoming daybreak. <laughs>